The Switch is a gimmicky handheld mess that throughout the years has months where its only function is to collect more dust than a ceiling fan. It has no native ethernet port, no native voice chat, and a slew of awful third-party games. It's a cancer on the earth, and the world would be better with it dead. I hate it to pieces. Overall, I give it a B. But today, we are rating Nintendo's newest app, Nintendo Music. Does it fill me with so much euphoria that it's warped my miserable existence into a wonderland? Or will this app belong in the toilet like every other piece of shit Miyamoto has taken this year? Let's get started. Nintendo Music is basically Spotify, but with Nintendo Music. And I know what you might be thinking, that's stupid, <laughs> but that's where. You're right, it is very stupid. So stupid, in fact, I hope the person that headed the development gets uncurable chlamydia. Overall idea, B-. At the moment, the app has some popular selections, and it does give fans a way of listening to Nintendo music. These same fans could do the same with an even bigger selection if they had YouTube Premium by making their own playlist. But Nintendo is betting that enough children, and adult children, don't care enough and will throw Nintendo money anyway. That's no surprise though, we all know Nintendo is famous for taking advantage of more children than P. Diddy. Music Selection D to use the service, a person will need NSO, which is the same service used to play online Switch games. Makes sense. Many are angry at the thought that Nintendo was asking for NSO to use the app, but I stupidly hypothesize this might be the start of Nintendo giving more perks to those that have NSO. With the Switch 2 on the horizon, maybe this means that there could be a potential of a Games Pass in the future? Maybe they'll innovate a way to make demos. Maybe I won't be a disappointment to my family anymore. NSO integration C+. Optimism of future implications aside, there are some on Twitter that are fearful of Nintendo possibly cracking down their copyright on YouTube and other social media platforms. At the moment, there are a lot of YouTube channels dedicated to Nintendo music, and there are thousands of videos online that are using Nintendo songs as background music. Nintendo is no stranger to canceling things. Will this be the end of Nintendo music online? Will evil Nintendo ban you from watching your Zelda Let's Plays on YouTube? Many don't know this, but I did some acting as a child. <laughs> But even I can't act like I give a shit about this Nintendo music app. I don't care about their wishes for music exclusivity and their potential war on us hearing music on any other app. I put my foot down, Nintendo. F you, in fact. F you and all you stand for. Final overall score B. You know you want me. Bitches hungry, let me 